Hi everybody, this is Gary Dean with Sentiment Timing and this is our technical video report for Monday, March 4th, 2024. Uh, really nothing really went on today uh, in the market. It was kind of boring. We saw a little chide to the upside and they, they pulled back towards the end of the day. But I, I really wouldn't be surprised if we don't see this uh, the same thing take place tomorrow. Because as I said in the morning notes, we have a lot of... Uh, economic numbers that are coming out uh, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. So I, I think the market is just going to kind of hover around and, and just see which way it reacts. But uh, if the, the bulls can take out the highs, this is that trend line that I was telling you about. So we're looking right around that 5170 if this is going to be the top. And really support should be right around, I'm just trying to move my trend line here. Alrighty. So support should be right around this uh right around these highs here so the, right around the 5109 if that gets taken out then we have the 5091 that's support but really in, until the bears can get it through this 5042 uh and you know even going down into the 5000 level i mean there, there's a lot of support levels right here that uh, you know they're gonna have to work through and they failed each time so it, you know maybe the economic numbers will do something I, i'm not sure it seems like everything that comes out the the market likes it but in any case, you know, it, it, they're going to have to take out these support levels. We have the bearish divergences if we get up. Uh, again, just look at that 5160, 5170 level. But I, uh, you know, I'm not. You know, I, I, I don't know if they're going to try to make it there before these uh, before the economic uh, numbers come out. So I think it's going to be kind of boring. So um, let's see what plays out tomorrow. Now, one thing I want to go over because I've had a bunch of calls today with uh, people and I appreciate you guys taking the time and going over some things. But let me just show you uh, uh, something that. We, you know, we're going over, I have a guy that that's helping me out with this. He was a wealth manager and, and knows a lot about options. But, you know, originally what I was saying is that you needed a big account for this. The, you know, I, had, I was helping my friend out that has a lot of uh, shares of Microsoft and Meta. But we started working it. I, I started doing this uh, with the daily options, and it, it's it, we worked out a you know it, it's we're not reinventing the wheel here. This is something that's been around. But what we're doing is training people how to do it, and on top of that, really the more important thing is the you know how how we're able to manage these trades where you don't really have to be in front of your computer because once you place it. Um, you're, you're going to put your stop in. You're either going to make a, a decent amount of money for that day or you're going to break even. And that's really what we're teaching in this class. But I just want to show you one thing because, um, you know, it, it, it doesn't t – it's not going to need – you know, your two, $3 million accounts to do this. It, they can be smaller. We're still trying to limit it to a, you know, we want people anywhere between a 50,000 and a hundred thousand in their account to be able to do this, but you, you're going to see that you can do it for less. So hang on one second. Okay. So the, really the main thing I want you to look at here is uh, this, this is for 20 contracts and it's the credit spread that I'm talking about. And it, notice the buying power effect. So this is, uh, you needed $6,850 uh, for this. This is a, uh, a Thinkorswim or TD Ameritrade, and now it's Schwab. But in any case, this is what you needed. But this is the credit that you would get if, if it works out. And and like I said, the, the thing that's... Uh, that's that's kind of cool about this, and and we've been doing a lot of testing with them and and back testing, and it, and it seems to work. But really, what happens is once you place the trade, we're we're able to put the stop losses in, and in their big spreads, and and the, these are daily uh, trades. They're not anything that's going out, uh, you know, weeks or two weeks. So they expire that day, and and I like doing them because. It, you're able if you're able just to, to get it where it falls within your spread, um, you, you collected thirty five hundred dollars or three thousand fifty six dollars. It's in your account now. If, if for some reason you go out and you know the the, the S and P ends up flying or, or crashing, you're going to get stopped out at your at your entry. So it, it's something that, like I said, we're, we're, we're still doing some things we're finding out through uh, through Thinkorswim, how, uh, Thinkorswim how, how the credit things work. But it's, um, 
it's something that this is what we were striving for because I th- we felt like we were just alienating a lot of people out there that, you know, just don't have the big trading accounts, even though that is the easiest way to do this. But in any case, uh, you know, it, these are things that where, you know, if, if it doesn't, let, let's just say out of the five days a week, you know, hey, if if each one of them closed within our big spread, then we're collecting three thousand, uh, you know, fifty six dollars. If uh, it, it, let's say out of them, only three of them work, then we're collecting nine thousand or almost ten thousand on it. Let's say two do. Now we're doing th- six thousand, but this is on a weekly basis. And again, you don't need a, a ton of of cash. I mean, like we're we're still only really looking to work with people that have anywhere from fifty to a hundred thousand in their account. Um, just because these are, you know, you gotta you gotta know what you're doing, but you will know it at the end of the, you know, at the end of this training course, you'll know everything about it, what to do, and and you could do them with stocks too. But we're we're they they're on a weekly basis, and we really kind of like just doing the daily ones and getting these credits. So, um, like I said, it, we've had a lot of people that have been uh, calling in. We've been going over some stuff. So if you, uh, you know, just click on that, that set a call and I'll go over some things. You know, I'm not going to go over everything, but what we will do is, uh, you know, show you how this works. And, and, and you really, the main thing is just knowing which prices to do. And that has to do with just some, some technical analysis, but you have a, you know, basically a 60 point spread uh, within the S&P. And as long as it stays within that, by the end of the day, you're, you know, you collect your premium on it. So with that, if you guys are interested, click on it, set a time. We'll, uh, we'll talk to you guys in the morning. Thanks.